Software Toolworks Star Wars Chess, well, that's kind of a mouthful, is a unique vision of the classic board game that came out in 1993 for PC and Sega CD. Essentially, it's battle chess with Star Wars characters, and even some of the deaths are pretty similar. Every time a piece is captured, you get treated with a death scene played out by your favorite Star Wars characters. Some of these deaths are pretty violent, or at least more violent than you would expect from the family-friendly Star Wars franchise. Not quite as violent as the deaths in the similar game Chess Wars, though. Ugh, it's horrifying. These deaths are easily the most interesting part of the game, however improbable. C-3PO killing Boba Fett? Yeah, like that would ever happen. I will admit though that there is a strange morbid curiosity involved in watching Darth Vader murdering Luke Skywalker that just can't be fulfilled in any other way than Star Wars death voyeurism. I'm a sick, sick man. But seriously, this game is made for people with the Galactic Empire tattoos that dream of an alternate universe where the Rebellion failed. Some of the characters look just slightly off in this game, like Vader looks a little weird, so does Yoda, and the voice actors did their best to sound like the originals, but they didn't quite nail it. Also, believe it or not, this game somehow made C-3PO even more, let's say, effeminate than normal, which is quite a feat. Each character has music for when they move, most of which is really cool, but some of the themes are unrecognizable. There are a few minor differences on the PC and Sega CD version, such as the board looks much more ornate in the PC version and even has a little image of Han and Carbonite in the corner, which is a nice touch. The Sega CD version is impressively similar in quality to the PC version though, which is a rarity for the platform, as I'm sure you know. I myself am not a huge chess player, but the Star Wars license can get me to play just about anything, and as far as chess games go, this has to be one of the most interesting and entertaining board games I've ever played. I'm Classy Man Jared, thanks for watching, and uh, if you have any suggestions for new classic game reviews, uh, shoot us an email or go to our forums at thegameheroes.com, and uh, we'll see what we can do. Thanks for watching.